So today I'm going to be doing a Charlene Woodley inspired makeup look. So I actually read The Fault in Our Stars and watched the movie and I love her. I think she's such a great actress and so pretty. I'm getting a little obsessed with her. A little bit. But I was going through some of her pictures on Google and I saw that most of the time she has a really natural look on and I thought um, it would be perfect to do a tutorial inspired by her and it's just a really simple look but it's great for every day or for back to school which is coming up and I'm sure most of you are not excited for it. I'm not excited to go back to college but whatever. Uh, it's a really simple and easy look and yeah, I hope you enjoy so let's be in. So Shailene has pretty great skin and I doubt she wears a lot of foundation but I don't have really great skin and so I'm going to be using a more full coverage foundation just to correct my skin and give that more flawless look to it. We'll just take my uh, Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and I will apply that on my under eye circles and on any blemishes that I have. And I'm also going to bring it onto my lids just to kind of work as a primer for the eyeshadow later. I'm just gonna set everything with a powder. The moon, I saw the shooting star and thought of you. Next, I'm gonna use this Essence Eyebrow Pencil just to give some definition to my eyebrows and fill in any uh, spaces. If you were here, I'd sing to you. I'm gonna take my Quadro Eyeshadow Palette from Essence and I'm gonna use the second lightest color. I'm just gonna apply that with my finger all over my lid just to give a little bit of a uh, just a light to the eyes but nothing too much. I can see the stars. And then I'm gonna take a black eyeliner pencil and I'm going to slightly just line my upper lash line um, just to give some definition to the eyes and I'm also going to be tight lining my eyes just to also give some just extra definition we're really going to define those eyes and make them pop And I'm gonna take the sponge little tip on the other side and I'm gonna use that to really smudge the eyeshadow just to soften it up a bit. And next I'm gonna take this cream liner from Clinique which is just a dark brown and I'm going to use this on my bottom waterline. This is gonna give some extra definition to the eyes but it's not going to be very harsh. On the Then I'm going to be curling my eyelashes and applying my mascara and I'm going to be using the Magnascopic mascara from Estee Lauder and I'm going to do about one coat of this mascara. I don't want to use too much because Shellyn doesn't wear a lot of mascara but it's going to be enough to just complete the eye look. Back And next I'm going to apply a light pink blush on my cheeks just to give a little bit of a color and I'm using this one from Maybelline. Can you see the stars? Oh, and for my lips I'm going to be using a little bit of this sun tint from MAC which is kind of like more of a clear lip gloss. I'm going to use just a little bit of this to give some shine to my lips and that's it. That is the finished look. It's very simple but it's really really pretty for every day and I hope you enjoy this.